of democracy shall be watered by the blood of revolution. Hey guys, it's Buddha Jim, and we've reached a milestone, I'd say, a thousand subscribers. I think it's really, it's like a thousand, one thousand forty something, forty six. Pretty cool. <laughs> um, you know, and I think, you know, most of us who really don't go into this with any kind of goal, I think that's how most of us get into YouTube. You know, we don't get into, you know, this goal, I'm going to have a million subscribers, I'm going to, you know, it's, uh, I think I speak for a lot of us on YouTube that start vlogging. Uh, a video catches our eye, you know, we're like, what? You know, I can't believe that person said that. You know, I think that's how it was for me. I think one of my first videos was um, in response to, it was either in response to a video about anarchy or it was a response to a video about Buddhism. I can't remember. It was one of the two, and I did both pretty uh, close to each other not really even knowing what YouTube was and um, you know I've done I don't know a couple hundred videos now and uh, you know over a thousand subscribers pretty cool and I just want to thank you uh, the people who stop and watch the videos I do or you comment um, you know it's the interaction the video responses the uh, comments um, it's what makes YouTube cool um, makes this a really uh, interesting forum to exchange ideas, to discuss things. Um, yeah, I know we get a little heated sometimes and you know it doesn't always go according to plan. <laughs> but uh, but that's the nature of politics, you know. Uh, do we want to be dispassionate in, you know zombies that just you know I mean it's good that we're passionate, you know. Um, I like it, you know. Um, hopefully you guys do too. Hopefully I'm going to have some, uh, a lot of new material for you guys. A lot of cool stuff coming up. Just want to give a shout out for anybody who's in the uh, New York area. We do have the uh, Anarchist Book Fair that's coming up uh, the weekend of April 10th. The weekend following that is the Left Forum. Um, I'll get, I, I plan on releasing some videos about that so you, you know, um, you know, if, if you're in the area, hit me up, man. There's a lot of cool stuff going on in the area. Um, wherever you're at, you know, dial in to what's going on, you know. Um, you know, it's cool that we can do this on YouTube, but really to affect things, we got to get out there. We have to organize with each other. We have to get active in our communities, you know. And I don't know where everybody lives. Um, I'm sure a quick Google search or, you know. Just getting out there and talking to people. Go to your local colleges, your universities. Um, there's always some activist groups, some peace and justice groups, uh, you know, anti-racist groups. Uh, there's always stuff going on at a college or university. Go check that out. Get involved. Um, that is the only way we change things. You know, um, it's fun. It's it's cool to like exchange ideas and to ponder things and to um, you know talk about theory but it's getting out in the real world and doing things that's that's the important part and one last thing I just want to say hopefully those of you who've watched me for a while I think it's pretty clear I'm not I'm not out to convert anybody to become a Buddhist uh, I'm certainly not out to convert anybody to become an anarchist <coughs> the purpose of my channel if there is a purpose is one to get maybe to get people to think or see things in a different way you know and I think in some videos I have two it's to uh, provide tools like my recent video they rule to provide tools to allow you to piece these things together you know where you can see the interconnectedness of corporate America um, you know or, or if it's uh, you know if it's a website or a book or different things you know gives you the tools to kind of put these things together um, and, and make whatever conclusions you make, of course. Um, and three is to maybe highlight some of the activism that's going on around here in the NYC area. Um, you know, whether it's uh, you know anti-war stuff or community organizing. Um, maybe it's just you know talks like Michael Prenti talk or Noam Chomsky or somebody. Um, but just to let you know that these things are going on. You know, it's not stuff you're going to see on the nightly news or in 60 minutes, maybe. But uh, it's going on all the time. 
you know, it's going on in your workplace, it's going on in your schools, it's, it's out there. So those are like the kind of parameters I work with, or the ideas I usually kind of go with. And, you know, you know in, in regards to tools, for instance, you know, sometimes I'll pick a, you know, some nitwit like uh, how the world works. And it's not because he's important or even the arguments that he gives have any merit. But they're typically, someone like that will uh, argue a point of view that you're going to hear uh, in the mainstream media. You know, and it, like for instance, his, he had, you know, he had this th ridiculous thing about these 32 scientists that signed a petition against global warming. You know, and you might be, you know, maybe, maybe you're not real hip to the whole environmental movement. Maybe you haven't read a ton about global warming, but you care about the place you live. You want clean air, you want clean water like any normal human and, you, you know, maybe, you know, you believe in global warming, like the majority of scientists on the planet. <laughs> so, and then some nitwit says, yeah, but did you know 32,000 scientists signed a petition? You know, well, you watch one of my videos and, we, you know, I go through how ridiculous that petition is. One, from a scientific point of view. Obviously, scientific truths are not determined by petition. But then when you actually look at the petition, it's just hilarious, you know. So... Uh, whether you're an anarchist or not, I mean, what I hope to do a lot of times is give you the tools to unravel a lot of the bullshit you'll come across. Hopefully I do that. Um, hopefully I succeed in that, that area. Um, but at any rate, it's fun. Um, I'm learning a lot as far as video editing and stuff, so that's pretty cool. And, uh, you know, here's to, you know, uh, some more videos and see where this leads us, alright? So, uh, again, a heartfelt thanks to all of you who, uh, you know, sit around and watch me <laughs> talk about whatever I'm talking about. Uh, peace.